guard boats left empty. They have abandoned us. Katorga 12 is doomed, and it appears they wish to bury their mistake. We're Oscar Mike. Head back to my position. Shit. More of those things. Grab that rifle. We gotta clear a path. Shoot! Let's move! Chopper! And it's not one of ours! Get down! Others have fled deeper into the island. Let's go. I must find my Nadia. Uh, finally. Jesus, it's like an antique show here. Titan 1, this is Devlin 4 1 Actual. Do you copy? Titan 1, this is Devlin 4 1 Actual. We're primed for extraction. All squadrons alert. Again with the Russians. Say again, this is Devlin 4 1. Man, they must be jamming our comms. It's all Russian all the time. Does anything work on this goddamn island? Of course not. This place has been abandoned for years. Who the hell is this? Shit, these guys don't look friendly. They have a really bad dude.
Captain Reiko. You are Captain Reiko, are you not? Don't look so surprised. Your name is right on your uniform. America's charming penchant for individuality. Now, I have some questions for you. Name, rank, and serial number. That's all you get from us, Ivan. Check your Geneva Convention handbook. I did away with that little inconvenience years ago. <laughs> States military. I want to talk to someone in our embassy. I think you'll find that impossible for a number of reasons. Our embassy, right now! That's better. How is it you haven't aged a day in 50 years? There is only one explanation. The TMD, where is it? Just follow the open doors. Run! Run! Turn right! Good. Now down the stairs and turn right. Keep running and look for the open doors. Move faster! Turn left! They're right behind you! Quickly, down the stairs! Nathaniel Renko. My god, you're here. Just like Mir-12 said. You must have a lot of questions, but we don't have a lot of time. Quickly, this way! Private Vogler! My name is Catherine. I belong to an organization known as Mir-12. Here, this should answer some of your questions. We are Mir-12. Our mission is to reveal the truth that's been hidden from the entire world. In the 1950s, a military research base was built on the island of Katorga-12. To this day, the government denies its existence. That is a lie. According to top secret documents we've uncovered, the base was the site of research involving the mineral E-99. The E-99 research program was headed by two men. Dr. Viktor Barasov, a top researcher in the field of quantum physics. He didn't live to see the outcome of his work. Reports say he was killed in an unexplained laboratory accident. This man stepped in to lead the program after Barasov's death. He went on to lead Russia in a war for world domination. A war won using super-powered weaponry developed at Katorga-12. Today, we know him as Chancellor Nikolai Demichev, leader of the world government. The events surrounding Demichev's rise to power are still a mystery. Our organization is in possession of a journal that claims Demichev is a fraud. It raises many questions about Katorga-12. What happened there to put Chancellor Demichev in power? What could have caused so much destruction and taken so many lives? Evidence points to this structure on Katorga-12, the Singularity. What is the Singularity? The journal claims one man will lead us to the answers. His name is Captain Nathaniel Renko. It is our mission to locate Captain Renko and help him achieve his goal. We are mere 12. We will reveal the truth. One of the lead scientists on the Singularity Project built a hidden vault. You must find it. Go through there. Here, two-way communicator with GPS. Now go!
Be careful. The radiation unleashed by the Singularity has mutated the people who used to live here. Keep your eyes open for them. shelter in a nearby warehouse when the singularity exploded. But then those things found us. There are only three of us left now. We have to get off this island. or they grew bored with us. We're safe for now. Pavel twisted his ankle and we fear it is broken. We'll rest here for tonight. <laughs> As luck would have it, our little haven has a chest set and a stash of vodka. All the comforts of home. you're searching for contains a device called the TMD. It was invented by Dr. Beresov, one of the scientists who worked here in the 50s.
According to the Mir 12 journal, there's a hidden entrance in this building that leads to the vault. Find it. signals off the grid, so I'm guessing you found the vault. It contains the device Demichev killed your friend for. The TMD.
Hello, I am Dr. Beresov, and this is Moscow Initiative Research Project, Film Log 19, relating to potential applications of the time manipulation device. Now, the device, or DMD as I've come to refer to it, uses... <laughs> I've got you on the GPS. For all our sakes, I hope you got the TMD. You must use it to go back to 1955 and stop Demachev from killing Beresov. He is the only one who knows how to restore history to the way it's supposed to be. Exploded, and the island is dotted with them.
I won't let you. I don't recall asking your permission. Just think about it. Only in Bereso, it has a nice ring. That's not what we created the singularity for. I try to be nice. I try to include you. But make no mistake, I will kill you if you don't tell me where the TMD is. You wouldn't. Do I look like I am bluffing, Victor? Very well. Give me no chance. D&D? How... You saved my life! You're wearing the D&D, and an American uniform. Something must have gone terribly wrong. Follow me. I need my notes. Damn it, Used to work on the singularity, but I never imagined he would resort to this. Let me get my notes. Damn it! It won't open! The TMD manipulates the aging process of objects, making them, for lack of a better word, Older or younger. Even the safe can decay over enough time. We're running out of time. Please, age the safe with the DMD. Here, take this. It is a prototype E99 weapon. It can be unstable, but should help tip the odds in our favor. Come <laughs> on. 
following demonstrates the practical applications of my breakthroughs in controlling E99 temporal distortions. The deadlock is a device that upon activation freezes all time within the radius. The effect has a limited duration, and it can be disabled with the use of gravimetric energy. It can be reactivated simply by deploying it again. The time distortion field also makes a very useful shield. I am certain that within a year my research will provide us with weapons that far surpass anything the West has. Then we can begin our conquest to communist victory. For the Soviet Union.